This is Anna, and I am watching this set, and I sat down at this seat because I wanted to talk. Um, these two are really good players, and I have not played enough to know all of their little habits and how good they actually are, but I know they're both really good. Um, I saw Kirama- oh, Kirama goes for the shield break, punishes the death smash, Rob goes down. On the gyro. Wow. I'm gonna just get back to it. It's gonna be a tough uphill battle for Rob, but it'd be really sick if he could make it. No bites. Because I don't know either if he's doing. Oski managed to take off a stock from Piranha. He's down a stock at 40. Now make that 45% or 50%. He's struggling to get back on the stage. But he catches from into a string. Really intense gameplay going on here. I'm bad at commentating. I need something to bounce off of. Oh, you're over here. Uh -huh. Yeah, I'm not very good at commentating. Oh, so we have a Sephiroth and a Rob. Yeah, it looks like the Rob, the Rob's down by quite a bit. But... Oh, and this is game one too. Yeah, it's game one. The thing is, Rob is a heavy character, so it must, so it's gonna be very hard to kill compared to Sephiroth. And if it's Rama though, is and when I'm taking no pants, already taken. Rama gets. Wipes out <laughs> Game one. Game one and the song with Mario surprisingly. Yeah. You would think because their name's Karama. <laughs> Alright. So maybe you just watched Naruto, or maybe he, there's another Karama from a different game. You know. Yeah. It's a nice sir. Looks like I don't which map did they pick? I forget. I didn't see. They picked it way too quickly. Yeah, it was probably okay. It was Hollow Bastion again. We saw Hollow Bastion. Okay, and we're already seeing a bit of damage. Thirty percent. Three seconds for Rosti and to Karama. But at the same time, Karama is putting on the same amount of pressure, evening up the percent amounts. The thing is that. Even though Karama can space out this Rob, if he ever gets gone on, then he just he's just gonna get combo to infinity. He has no real ways to escape it. Yeah, especially with Sephiroth being so light for whatever reason, uh, the Rob is gonna die. Isn't gonna die as soon as uh, as soon as Sephiroth. So. so Karama's gonna have to play really consistently safe, like consistently well, space perfectly. Either that or we'll play as aggressive as possible. Yeah, exactly. I saw a shield group coming out um, last game. If you can do that again, you can definitely take a stock easy. And obviously, you know, this was a one wing mid for him. The one wing angel. Yeah, really powerful comeback mechanic and also just, you know, mechanic. 
When he has one winged angel, he can do so much more. He, he goes fast in front. He's like Cloud with a little bit of better. Because he gets uh, better recovery too. He gets better recovery, he gets three jumps. And 10% damage increase on everything? I don't know too much about it. I think I, I, I looked at it, it was like... I know it's like a smash attacks become basically yeah, just yeah. jump. Get super armor on smash attacks. I can't, oh! The playmaker is going. He's gone. Super armor really high percent, but he's cracking up that percent on Osti before he dies. As Austin in disadvantage, looking for an up air. Can he get it? Yeah. Ooh, but Austin reverses, trying to get that kill, uh, confirm that kill. It doesn't work. Darrow knocks him back off onto stage. Can Karama get back onto stage? No, he gets extra. Uh, he still lives, but the laser takes him out. Ooh, shield almost broken. Rob playing with fire, walking into a down smash, gets down air. Karama trying to look for a combo right. here. Oh! This, oh, this is looking like a very, very interesting game for Karama. Gets down air spike by fucking Rob! Holy lay. Alright. Rob now has the advantage, but... Karama's now going... He's going to be going into one of the angel mode soon because of the uh, stock gap. Will Rob be able to hold on despite that? Is the real question. Krom is looking for something, but he just keeps connecting with the blue shield. Gyro is spacing him out so insanely well. It's turned from a Karama spacing match into an Osti spacing match. Karama at 70%, he can die to an up throw up air or a down throw up smash from Rob. Will we see it? A Rob! Ooh! Thought he failed his recovery there, but again, he's back. Looking for more percent on that set for Rob. But he's after 400 angel mode. Takes the stock, and he is still there. Looking for a chain onto the Rob. It's working. There, there. Trying to catch him with the up air. Really nice Nair from the Rob. Down smash trying to catch the shield break or two frame. It's very close within 25% of each other. But set her off still has the one playing at Angel. Hits him with a down smash to the sour spot. Flare comes out, hits him with nothing. Doesn't even edge guard. Ooh, Nair from the Rob takes it. And now, Karama and Oski have tied one. Alright, they're heading to Pokemon Stadium 2. Wait, yeah, they're heading to Pokemon Stadium 2 for their third match. This will be their final match because. Uh, until best of, or, uh, best of 8, or top 8. It's only best of three, is it? When it hits top eight, it will be best of five. This is the match to decide who will be heading into the winners round four and who will be going to losers brackets. Obviously. The winner of this match will be fighting secrets. I don't know much about it because I don't know I'm I'm near the same people. Back to the game. The Rob has taken 85% in only 20 seconds. Wow. Uh, but he's quickly retaliating. The Sephiroth getting up to 50% easily. Oh, slash hitting instantly, sending Rob down a stock. Ooh. Looks like he's trying to get a comeback here. But the counter comes out and you hit him with three Shadow Flares. We'll be able to. Okay, frame skips. Unlucky. One Winged Angel comes out from Karama, trying to secure that next stock. But these projectiles coming out from the Rob, they're so annoying for him. Really, really good spacing for him, though. Aussies at this point is just trying to get something 
beautiful. Bathroom right there just annihilates Karama's first stuff with the Shadow Flare plus grab up smash. Sends him straight into the stratosphere. 138 about to die. Hits him with the dash attack dead on impact. Right now, Karama has so much to work with. He is just really just rolling in it. He's keeping rack up a percent lead on Oski, but he has. Uh, he threw his sleep before, last game. Uh, can he take it down? One move I haven't seen from this Rob has been the side view. If I remember correctly, Rob's side view is a very strong move, so I'm surprised it hasn't come out at all. Or is that it? I thought that was the down smash. I, I don't play Rob. That's cool though. Karama down to his last stock. Still percent lead for him over the Rob, but Rob is a heavy and Karama, not so much. Getting spot dodge on the down tilt. Got a break coming out. Karama spacing really well. Unable to shield the Shadow Flare. Ooh, back for a back air. Dead. Karama wins 2-1.